fresh out, freaked out, sound familiar, you just graduated, you're finally out in the real world. No more exams, no more dorm food, right? But then, reality hits. Paychecks seem to disappear faster than you can say student loan payment. Sound familiar? You're not alone. Tons of people in their 20s feel overwhelmed by their finances. It's a whole new ball game, and the rules can feel like a foreign language. Don't freak out. Seriously, take a deep breath. You're about to learn the plays, and trust me, you don't need to be a financial whiz to get this. We're going to break down common money mistakes, show you how to dodge them, and get you on the path to living that rich life, whatever rich means to you. Your 20s exhilarating, terrifying, and expensive? Think about it. Your 20s are a whirlwind. You're starting your career, maybe moving to a new city, figuring out who you are. It's exciting. But it also comes with a whole new set of financial challenges. Rent, bills, maybe even those pesky student loans are suddenly staring you down. Plus, there's the temptation to keep up with the Joneses. You know, those friends who always seem to be jet-setting or rocking the latest gadgets. Don't sweat it. We've all been there. The key is to understand the financial traps waiting for you and learn how to sidestep them like a pro. Ready to take control and make your 20s the decade of smart money moves? Let's go. The big spending traps, living like a rock star on a peanut butter budget. Let's face it, there's a ton of pressure to live large, especially in your 20s. Instagram feeds overflowing with exotic vacations and designer everything can make it tempting to overspend. But here's the harsh truth. Living beyond your means is a surefire way to financial misery. Those credit card swipes for fancy dinners and weekend getaways might feel good in the moment, but they can lead to a mountain of debt that's way harder to escape than that hangover. Here's the deal. You don't need to impress anyone. Focus on building a solid financial foundation. That means living within your means, saving for the future, and making smart choices with your money. Remember, true wealth isn't about flashing cash. It's about having financial security and the freedom to live life on your own terms. Debt disasters. When that buy now, pay later comes back to bite. We've all heard the siren song of buy now, pay later. It's so easy to get sucked into the instant gratification trap, whether it's the latest smartphone, a trendy outfit, or that weekend getaway with friends. But here's the kicker. Racking up debt, especially high-interest credit card debt, is like strapping yourself to a financial anchor. It can drag you down for years, preventing you from achieving your financial goals. Think of it this way. Every dollar you're paying in interest is a dollar you can't use for something you actually care about, like that dream vacation, a down payment on a house, or early retirement. Don't let debt control your life. Make a plan to pay it down strategically, starting with the highest interest debt first. Your future self will thank you. The credit score conundrum. Why your future self will thank you for caring. Credit scores. Just the words can make your head spin. The concept of credit scores can be daunting, especially when you're just starting out and trying to navigate the world of personal finance. It might seem like one of those adulting things you can ignore for now, but trust me, your credit score is a big deal. Ignoring it can lead to missed opportunities and financial setbacks that could have been easily avoided. Think of it as your financial GPA. It tells lenders how risky you are to lend money to. Just like your academic GPA can affect your future educational opportunities, your credit score can significantly impact your financial future. A good credit score can open doors to lower interest rates on loans, better credit card rewards, even better apartment rental options. Imagine being able to secure that dream apartment or get a loan for a new car with ease. On the flip side, a low credit score can haunt you for years, making it harder to get approved for loans, rent an apartment, or even land certain jobs. The good news? You have the power to change it. Building a good credit history is easier than you think. It requires consistent, responsible financial behavior, but the steps are straightforward and manageable. Pay your bills on time, every time. This is one of the most critical factors in maintaining a good credit score. Setting up auto pay can help ensure you never miss a payment. Keep your credit card balances low. High balances can negatively impact your credit score, even if you pay them off in full each month. Aim to use only a small portion of your available credit and avoid opening too many accounts at once. Each new account can lower your average account age and result in a hard inquiry on your credit report, both of which can lower your score. By taking these steps, you can build a strong credit history that will benefit you for years to come. Budgeting basics. It's not about deprivation, it's about domination. Ugh, budgeting. The word alone can make you want to dive under the covers and hide. It conjures up images of endless spreadsheets, cutting out all the fun, and living a life of constant penny-pinching. It sounds restrictive, boring, maybe even a little scary. 
The thought of having to account for every single dollar can feel overwhelming and tedious, but here's a secret. Budgeting isn't about deprivation, it's about domination. It's about taking control of your financial destiny and making your money work for you. Domination over your money, that is. When you budget, you are the one in charge. You decide where your money goes, rather than wondering where it went. It's about making conscious choices about where your money goes so you can free up more cash for the things you truly value. Start simple. Begin by identifying your needs versus your wants. Track your spending for a month to see where your money is actually going. This will give you a clear picture of your financial habits and help you identify areas where you can cut back. Then, create a realistic budget that aligns with your income and goals. Make sure to include categories for savings and investments, not just expenses. There are tons of apps and tools out there to help you, from Mint to You Need a Budget, YNAB. These tools can simplify the process and make it easier to stick to your budget. The key is to find a budgeting system that works for you and stick with it. Consistency is crucial. Regularly review your budget and adjust as needed. Remember, it's not about being perfect, it's about making progress. Celebrate your small victories along the way. Each step forward is a step towards financial freedom and security. Share your journey with others. Discussing your financial goals and challenges with friends or a community can provide support and accountability. You might even inspire someone else to take control of their finances. Educate yourself continuously. The more you learn about personal finance, the better equipped you'll be to make informed decisions. Read books, attend seminars, and stay updated with financial news. Ultimately, budgeting is about empowerment. It's about feeling confident and in control of your financial future. So, take that first step today and start your journey towards financial domination. Investing 101. Planting money trees while you're still young. This section is all about getting started with investing early in life. Investing. It can feel intimidating, like something only Wall Street hotshots do. The fast-paced world of stocks and bonds can seem overwhelming, but here's the deal. You don't need to be a financial genius or have a ton of money to start investing. Even small steps can lead to big rewards. Think of it this way. Investing is like planting money trees. Just as a tree grows from a tiny seed, your investments can grow over time. The earlier you plant, the more time your money has to grow. Starting young gives your investments the advantage of time. Even small, consistent contributions can add up to significant wealth over time thanks to the magic of compound interest. This means your money earns money which then earns even more money. Don't know where to start? No worries. It's normal to feel a bit lost at first. There are tons of resources available, from online articles and books to financial advisors who can help you create a personalized investment strategy. You can learn at your own pace. Start with the basics. Explore low-cost index funds which are a great way to diversify your investments without high fees. Consider opening a Roth IRA, a retirement account that offers tax advantages and can be a powerful tool for long-term growth. And don't be afraid to ask questions. Seeking advice is a smart move, not a sign of weakness. Remember, the best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. This old saying highlights the importance of starting early. The second best time is today. So take that first step now and watch your money tree grow over the years. Your future self will thank you. Small steps, big wins, you don't have to be Warren Buffett, yet. Feeling overwhelmed? Don't worry, you don't have to become a financial expert overnight. The key is to start small and focus on building sustainable habits. Start with one thing at a time. Maybe it's automating your savings, tackling a small debt, or simply tracking your spending for a month. Once you've mastered one habit, move on to the next. Remember, progress is better than perfection. Don't beat yourself up if you slip up. Just get back on track and keep moving forward. You've got this. Let's get real share your money moves and mishaps. Let's be real. We've all made financial mistakes. The important thing is to learn from them and keep moving forward. What are some of the biggest financial challenges you're facing in your 20s? What are your money goals and aspirations? Share your experiences, questions, and tips in the comments below. Let's create a supportive community where we can learn from each other and achieve our financial goals together. Your rich life. It's closer than you think. Remember, building a rich life isn't just about accumulating wealth. It's about having the financial freedom to pursue your passions, enjoy life's experiences, and make a difference in the world. By taking control of your finances, making informed decisions, and avoiding common money mistakes, you're setting yourself up for a brighter financial future. Don't let fear or uncertainty hold you back. Start small, stay consistent, and never stop learning. You've got this.